Yo, yo, yo. That's wild. Alright. Welcome back. Let me see if the spam button works. Oh, the spam button's working again. It's a miracle. Well, the spam button's working. The website's still working. Welcome back. Uh, before we even start, I want to say, uh, I want to say thank you to Collectra for coming with me to buy some of the stuff. I want to say thank you to, uh, the NACDO, uh, at the NACDO on Instagram, uh, for selling me some of this stuff for near retail. Um, and just people, everybody interacting and stuff, you know, uh, ripping packs too, uh, solo cooking on insta he's ripping this stuff you can find this stuff at target now so i'm gonna just start ripping into it now i'm gonna uh rip in right and then uh i'm gonna start by ripping in We'll divide the packs by what they are. So we got a Guardian Eidos there, and then we got Dark Crisis and Invasion of Chaos. So I think these are 15 bucks each at Target for uh, for these blister type ones there. Yo, Ryan, what's up? So pick these up. At all different times, really. So they're gonna be mixed. Sometimes they were blue eyes. Sometimes they were metal raiders. Sometimes they were I don't know what. So um, and also got these from very. Oh, so there's a blue eyes. Nice. Glory of the King's Hand. I'm sure this that must be a token card, I guess. No effect on that. A Pharaoh servant. So we got four different packs so far. So, again, all this is from Walmart or Target recently, so. If you're going to Target and you can't find any Pokemon, check for some Yugi's. The Blue Eyes packs are available for purchase. The green packs are not going to open any of those, but like this. They come with a stack of cards and a different amount of hollows, so you can't really weigh these. And there's one pack in there, and you can tell which pack it is. These red ones, it's kind of hard to tell. I think I get it right every time, but then that's when I get it wrong, so. Uh, let's see, we got another, what do we got here? Another token. Sale. Set sale for the kingdom. <clears throat> and then we'll just start ripping packs once we get through these. Save the better packs for the end. Blister packs are definitely the way to go. And these are <clears throat> reprint packs. Most of these are going to read 2017, I believe. So another Invasion of Chaos, another Dark Crisis. So we're all tied up so far. We got Final Fusion Trap Card. Two Pharaoh Servant, two Blue Eyes, two Dark Crisis, two Invasion of Chaos. So if you're wondering what's with the Band-Aid... Uh, I took a spill at work and took a chunk out of my thumb there, and there's a little bit of, little bit of some other damage there too, but it's not actually too bad. More dark, dark crisis and invasion and chaos. Okay. IOC, not bad. Dark crisis is very hated on. They say not even worth opening, but. We're gonna open it. Maybe we'll, we'll uh, do a band aid reveal if the chat gets good. Alright, so nice. We got another blue eyes and another Pharaoh servant. So is it all tied up again? It's 3 3 and 3 now. Nice. No metal raiders. Oh, here we go. There's metal raiders there. I was gonna say no metal raiders and no magic ruler. 
so those are falling behind now. Ouch. I hurt still. Do you want maybe we'll do a reveal of the uh, the wound. If we get enough chat chat votes to reveal the wound, I'll reveal it. I should have put some uh some of the pain cream on it before this. IOC and MRD, the first metal raiders. We're gonna we're gonna stack these in order now. Do we have one of each? Oh, we're still missing. So, Dark Crisis first, then IOC, then Pharaoh Servant. Leave a space for Magic Ruler, Metal Raiders, and Blue Eyes. We'll save for less, and then we'll open up the uh, the boxes as well. Who we got there? Uh, goes from the past and is it maximum gold the gold blue eyes white dragon also there is the ghost blue eyes white dragon so that'll be fun trimid sphinx all right we got metal raiders nice and finally spell ruler all right there's the rainbow all of them besides Magician's Force, which they didn't reprint. I was thinking about adding some Ma Magician's Force packs into this, but then, uh... Uh, it wouldn't be all retail, because you can't... Magician's Force never reprinted, so... Red Eyes Burn. <clears throat> Metal Raiders. And another Invasion of Chaos. So another... A lot of IOC... They're all reading 2017, which is around the time that uh, Evo was printing. So that's kind of why you're going to see the 2017, is this is with their way to compete with Evo after the Evil Empowering Dragon. Another MRD and Spell Ruler. So MRD is now caught up. Let's go. Spell Ruler, nice, nice. Luna the Leo Dancer. Pretty sure this card is like almost meta, if not meta. Those Luna like cards you gotta watch out for. Alright, here we go. Um, Metal Raiders and Spell Ruler. Very nice. Depth Shark, Ultra Rare, nice. Dusa, English, 003, the Depth Shark. Pretty cool. Alright. Last of the double packs, so we got through that quick. This will be good now. Let's go. Uh, Metal Raiders, the Ruler. Pharaoh Servant in there, Spell Ruler in there, these are the one packers, they come with a bunch of cards, oh, I think I threw out a card there, yeah, those are the hollows, not hollows, one pack, Pharaoh Servant, what did I throw out here? Ritual Beast Tamer. Zephramplica. Holy schmoly. How could I throw that one out? Yo, what's good? We're going to open up this massive pile of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. What is this? A skill card? What the heck? I've never seen this before. Weevil skill card. Very interesting. Always something new in these uh, repacks, so hopefully that's a lucky one. That's a spell ruler. Is that the last spell ruler? 
will be the first spell ruler we actually open when we get to it. Again, we're going to start with Dark Crises, which we only got three packs of Dark Crises. That's good. Nice fat stack of metal. Oh, we got another one of these. Look, another, the same thing, back to back. That was in an MRD pack that time, and another MRD pack here. So no hollows at all. And two of those weird cards. Some speed duel cards in there and no hollows. So, uh, there we go. Alright, that's it. Let me get some of this uh, filler out of the way. Thank you guys for tuning in and dropping the likes. Always appreciate it. And thank you again to those who helped out to make this possible. Let's start ripping. Let's do a count first. So, I don't even remember how many blisters there were, but we got three packs of Dark Crises. So, the, on the top and the bottom, there's three. Three packs of Dark Crises, as well as three packs of Blue Eyes White Dragon. We got five packs of IOC. We got. Four packs of Pharaoh Servant. We got six packs of Mag Spell Ruler. Almost called the Magic Ruler, Spell Ruler. We got three, six, nine packs of Metal Raiders. Excellent. Yeah. And then three packs of Blue Eyes. All right. <clears throat> and then a couple boxes to open at the end, if there's time. I want this to take uh, an hour, so actually the counter is not going. Let's see how far we're 15 minutes in. So, we've got 45 minutes to go. Yo, Ron Stoppable. Huge ripping tonight. Massive Yu Gi Oh! rip. So it'll be four from the back, uh, and then the second to last card will be the hollow. If there is a hollow. If there's no hollow, then. Second to last card will be hot. All right, time to switch to rip mode. Let's go. We're doing dark crises first, so we're gonna go through these kind of quick here. Sticking together, maybe we can get something good though. Pajama trio. So this is where the hollow would be. That's the uh, Maju Garzette. Some of these cards can be worth a couple bucks, three, four bucks in this set. Uh, and the Feral Imp. Not, that is one that is not worth a couple bucks. So. Four from the back. Well, actually, we'll just do five from the back. So if there is a hollow, it'll be the last card. If there if there's no hollow, then it'll just be a real womp 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 situation. A real kind of womp 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 situation. <clears throat> no hollow. Alright, Dark Crises beating us up here. If we're going to get beat up, let it be in Dark Crises at least. Archfiend Soldier. Okay. Should have emptied the trash before I sit there. Go full screen mode. I'm out of practice here. Alright, here we go. Expert in battle. It'll be the last card if there's a hollow. I'm taking two at a time. So I waste the time. And no hollow from Dark Crises. Okay, if we're not going to get a hollow from one, let it be Dark Crises. IOC. Next. Evasion of Chaos. I forget what the chase card is in here, to be honest. But I know it's definitely better than our crises. So compulsory evacu evacuation device. A good trap card. DNA transplant. Chaos greed. Torpedo fish. Crimson ninja. The witch doctor of chaos. Chaos sorcerer. And zero gravity. Oh, there's one more. It's a hollow. Nice. So our fourth pack. Hollow odds should be one in four packs. 
uh, for Yu-Gi-Oh here. It's one in three for Pokemon. It's one in four for Yu-Gi-Oh. So Chaos, Gustav, IOC, zero one eight. Pretty cool. All right. At least we got a sleever. And I know we're on the right track. We're we're marking hollows. Okay. All right. Yep. So rare should be on top. Destruction ring. The bomb ring. Literally. Pajama black. Paper crane. Zero gravity from the reveal. Oh, Nave. And we got a chaos sorcerer. A lot of packs to go. Stealth Bird on the reveal. Five cards to the front. Another destruction ring. Torpedo Fish, though. Cool one. A good one for the water deck, I think. Not 100% sure on that. The Serpent in the Darkness. Balloon Lizard. Oh, nice. Ultra Rare. Dimension. Fusion. Pay 2,000 life points. Both players summon as many of their removed play monsters as possible. Incredible. That's very good. Ultra rare card. Turned it around in the IOC. For sure. Actually didn't have any top loaders out, so I'll have to rip a, rip a fresh pack. Nice. Ultra rare. Very nice. Ultra rare early. Ultra rare should be 1 in 12 packs, so... Uh, hopefully we didn't burn the ultra rare early. But pretty cool. We're only uh, we're only about six packs in to pull an ultra rare right now. It's very nice. Dimension fusion. Pay two thousand life points. Both players summon as many of their removed play monsters as possible. So you got a lot of monsters removed from play, and you got a lot of life points. So that's a good one to pop off. All right, still two packs left of IOC, and we already got two hollows. Two, three, four, five. Yeah. Pahuma Shuriken. Spatial Collapse. Lord Poison. Thunder Clash. Cards we haven't seen out of this yet. This could be a hot pack. We've seen that one though. Hey, right, cool. Okay. And oh, nice. Wow. Another one. Holy smokes. Two ultra rares. Wow. Good thing I opened up the top loaders. Good thing I opened up the top loaders. Oh my goodness. Manticore of Darkness. This one's probably really good. During your end phase, if any. During your end phase of any turn, if this card is sent to the graveyard, you can send one beast. Beast Warrior or Winged Beast type monster card from your hand or your side of the field to the graveyard to special summon this card from your graveyard. Interesting. Alright, let's go. I don't know why YouTube's the ticker's not counting on YouTube, how long it started. Or even who's watching. All right, Stray Lambs, another rare that we haven't seen. Recycle. Oh, Skull Mark Ladybug. This is one that's worth like a dollar. I, don't know, I should probably start a separate pile, but I'm just, I'll just go through them la later. Pretty cool. All right. Nice. A hero emerges. That one might be two. Let's see. Oh man, no way. Another hollow. So what was it? Five packs? 
Five packs, three hollows. Insane. Wow. Remember to smash the like if you're watching. Uh, subscribe. We'll be doing more of this soon. Also, you can buy Blue Eyes packs on the website. Shipped 25 bucks. And you get open them by high. I think there's like 30 of them. So, I'll let you pick yours too out of the box. Light shoes. So, Pharaoh's servant starting off cold. PSV. Come on, Pharaoh's servant. The better cards will come from the end packs. So, uh,. Hopefully we didn't uh, burn the ultra rares there early. Hopefully those are just little kickers. Late intervention. I'm gonna try to pronounce that one. Major right. Infinite. This small. Shadow of eyes and insect imitation. Oof. Oof. Come on, baby. Forked requisition. Forced re requisition. Excuse me, not forked. <laughs> Mystic probe. Deep Sea Warrior. Okay. Winged Weaver. Nice. Uh, Luminous Healer, World Suppressor, Souls of the Forgotten, and nice, Premature Burial, Ultra Rare, pay 800 life points, select one monster card from your graveyard, special summon it on the field in face up attack position and equip it with this card. When this card is destroyed, the monster is also destroyed. So, pretty cool there. Nice one. <clears throat> uh, ultra rares are supposed to be one in 12 packs, so um, we have three ultra rares. And maybe, have we opened 12 packs? Probably getting close to 12 packs. But still, uh, three ultra rares and full packs is pretty good. All right, cool. Two ultra rares from one set and one from the another so far. Dark Crisis, the only one who did not yield holographics. Dark Crisis also being the one uh if we didn't get holographics oh monster recovery so this is another good one to get that's not a hollow maybe indicative of a hot pack as well the twin headed fire dragon iconic overdrive inspection burning land dark fire soldier driving snow metal detector sweet and seven complete Awesome. Another iconic card from the anime. Alright, so not too bad. One ultra rare. We'll take it. Alright, moving into Spell Ruler now. With the possibility of getting a Toon Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let's go. So this is, this is starting to heat up now. Spell Ruler into Metal Raiders and then to cap it off with Blue Eyes. And then we'll open up the boxes. We're gonna do a Kaiba box. We'll do Ghost from the Past, and we'll finish it off with maximum gold. All right. You killed it, dude.
Yeah, can't quit my day job yet. Horn of Light and... Oh, Black Illusion Ritual. Nice. You go with that Relinquished. Black Illusion Ritual is the card you pair with Relinquished. So, even though it's not an Ultra Rare, I'm going to throw it in the top order. And the 10, probably worth a couple bucks. <laughs> The card used to summon Relinquished. Not bad for not an ultra rare. Alright, let's go. Spell Ruler starting off hot. Not bad. Let's get some ultra rares out of this. Hayu Zenru. Another iconic card from the anime. I think they're going to redo this card, or they did recently. Wall Shadow. Another strong one to have in your deck. Early on. Minara from the reveal. Psychopa. Another Horn of Light. To reveal a Labyrinth Wall. 3000 defense. Alright. Only three more uh three more spell ruler packs after this. Three more chances at that tune blue eyes. Never pulled a tune blue eyes myself. I think I traded as a kid to get one. I have one in my binder, but it's all messed up. None of my cards got that mess. Messed up. Commencement dance and another black illusion ritual. Really? Well, if one wasn't a 10, hopefully the other is. Gotta figure out which one's nicer of the two here. Which one's better centered. This one doesn't look like it's centered that great. Yu-Gi-Oh cards are hard to tell and hard to grade. Because even if it's off a little bit, there's not much room for error there on the small border. So, yeah, this one looks like it's sitting to the, uh, to the right side a little bit more than the other one. So... Not bad though. Again, if it's not going to be an ultra rare, uh, let it be. Uh, let it be a good rare. I think they're all good rares, though. To be honest, into these packs. Senju of the Thousand Hands, Fire Kraken, Gaia Power, Ancient One of the Deep Forest, which is just really a goat with little tiny wings and nine tails, Final Destiny, Curse of Fiend, Guardian of the Throne Room, House of the Adhesive Trap, and Giant Grenade. Another good. Hollow, not rare. And the centering, not great on this one, though, sadly. Sadly, centering, not great. And again, it's really hard to tell on these cards. But maybe not. Maybe you guys can see it too. It's heavy on that left side there. Two more packs left of Spell Ruler. Ryu Ran, that's usually a good sign. Last time we got a Ryu Ran, it was a good sign. If it's a good sign again, we might have to top load that Ryu Ran. UFO Turtle, that's already a good one. Love you. Penguin Knight, alright, this is a hot pack for sure. We got three good cards so far. Ryu Ran, Penguin Knight, and UFO Turtle.
This is nuts. The third one. Holy shamoly. One of these got to be a 10. Where's the relinquish at? We got three cards to summon them. I think that's probably what you want to have in your deck, realistically, if you're battling. Dang, three pack rushes. They're probably all nines looking at the centering, but maybe not. First one looked like it was slightly better. It'll be easy to tell comparing three of them together, though, at least. Alright. Four hollows. That's pretty good. Mystic Tomato. Rare we haven't got yet tonight. Fear Cretan. Ugh. Fear Cretan. Wow, look at that card. That's an intense one. Koto Dama. Liquid Beast. And the final one is Fairy's Hand Mirror. Alright. So, a pile of holographics out of Spell Ruler. Really can't complain too much. Nothing better than a rare, though. Three Black Illusion Rituals and a Giant Tornade. So, if you're battling, though, you're, that's a pretty... You've you're got your magic cards you need from, uh, from those packs. So now, a unit of Metal Raiders packs. We've got four... Yeah, nine packs, like I thought. Good chance at, at uh, an Ultra Rare with nine packs. Let's hope for the best. One, two, three, four, and five. Damn. Oof, oof. What is that on there? Hopefully. Oh. Milus Radiant. Cool looking card. Giselle, the King of the Mystic Beasts. Hunter Spider. Cocoon Evolution. Hail Beast. Mystic Horseman. Lava Battle Guard, Dream Clown, and a Karibo. All right. Starting off hot with the Lucky Karibo. Let's go. Let's go. All right, next. No, the Metal Raiders. Alright, first pack magic there with the Karibo. Another rare card that's... Karibo, though, is almost an ultra rare. Like, come on, it's Karibo. That's better than a lot of rares. <laughs> Masked Sorcerer. I forget what the other sorcerer we got was. Bottom Dweller. This guy's strong. Keminar Keminari attack. Osu Beam and Mega Thunderball. Lady Faith. Electric Lizard. The Bistro Butcher. And. Musician King and uh Destroyer Golem. Oof. Cold pack there. Alright, come on, Metal Raiders. Let's get that time wizard. Still have yet to pull a time wizard from a pack. Found a time wizard the other day. Or a couple weeks ago. I'm trying to pull one. Mask Darkness. Skull Knight. Card Insect Soldiers of the Sky, another cool one. Jellyfish Swamp Battle Guard Rainbow Flower Tough Pack Ancient Lizard Destroyer Golem. All right, let's go. And Change of Heart Ultra Rare. Okay, no Time Wizard. Time Wizard eludes us, but an Ultra Rare. This is the what the fourth Ultra Rare tonight. 
Very nice. Change of heart. Nicely centered, actually. For Metal Raiders. My favorite series of early Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Change of heart. Absolutely gorgeous looking card. Right there with Karibo. Nice. Couple packs left of Metal Raiders as well. Star boy, let's go. More battle guard. Nubatori. Dome of the Angel of Silence. The Dragon Piper. Painted Wisdom. Seven colored fish. Teal. Scorpion. An effect card with low attack and defense. I thought that might have been Time Wizard. I almost freaked out. I almost freaked out. Alright, change of heart at the top of the list right now. Hopefully we can still turn it up from here. We still got a couple chances, but still. Change of heart, not bad to get. Change of heart, not bad. Blue wing crown. Petite moth. Uh, <laughs> horrible. Doesn't get worse than that. Doesn't get worse than that. All right, let's go. Come on, baby. Even if it's a little off center, we'll take it at this point. Where is that TW? P to the W. P Wizzy. P to the Wiz. Thunder Dragon. There's one that's worth a dollar. Lava Battle Guard. Dream Clown. Guardian of the Labyrinth. And. Castle of Dark Illusions. No T Wizzy. No T to the Wizzy. Another Star Boy. Crawling Dragon. So far on that one. Larva Moth. King Yami Makai, Giselle again, Tremendous Fire, Tense looking card, Jokoi Kosi, Joji Kosi, Seven Colored Fish again, oh no way, Gate Guardian, oh wow, this one seems to be a little bit heavy on the right side, but wow dude, Gate Guardian, oh Nick Strength and Power, welcome dude, you showed up just in time, the Gate Guardian, I should really get a, a what's it called for this, but uh, it's not like it's going to PSA anytime soon. Actually, PSA is supposed to open pretty soon, I think. Nice. Okay, Guardian takes the top of the pile now. Beautiful card. Couple packs left. All right, we, we have, we're gonna stand the big guardian now. Wow, was not expecting that. The secret rare from Metal Raiders. 
The Gate Guardian. Ring of Magnetism, Ground Attack, Team Victory, all those now, another Dragon Piper, Tainted Wisdom, and we got a Seven Colored Fish at the back of the pack that time. Pretty much a Seven Colored Fish in every pack. Giant, a uh, great moth. Iconic. Another one that's worth a dollar. All right. Labyrinth tank, the first labyrinth tank we've seen. Rainbow right, flower and come on, baby. Let it be the last one. Oh, Harpy Lady Sisters. Not bad. Yeah, Gay Guardian, dude. Can't believe it either. Harpy Lady Sisters, though. I saw some guy pull this uh, the other night, too. And he, like, started... Na naming each girl by their names. I have no idea what their names are. Can't recall even what he said, but there are some real Harpies Ladies fans out there, folks. Alright. Last three packs are Blue Eyes White Dragon from Target. Let's go. These are the big hitters now. I would love to see a Trihorn Dragon. Haven't ever pulled one of those. Pretty much pulled everything else out of here. Not a Trihorn Dragon. Blue, blue Eyes Packs. Here we go. Flower Wolf Rare to kick it off. M Warrior number one. LOB. Remove Trap. LOB 080. The Furious Sea King, Dark Energy, Terra the Terrible, Tyhoon, Skull Servant, and Mountain. First pack cold. Oh man. Alright. Still two left. Yu-Gi-Oh packs are chance of holographic in these vintage type packs are one in four. So I think in the booster boxes too, uh, one in four. The modern booster boxes can't get booster boxes of these sadly, but I still believe the hollow chances one. In, it seems to be like it's one in four. No, we got way more. I think tonight. Two pronged attack is the rare. Inutama, red medicine, all iconic cards so far, and uh, is there Zami? Not good. All right, we really need some last pack magic here. L P M, let's go. Dragon capture jar. Let's capture a dragon. Dragon treasure. Let's get that dragon treasure. Beaver. 
I don't know if you want to say it. Try that one again. Masaki. Dark King of the Abyss. And Mystic Elf. Alright. LB ended on a hollow. It's a Mystic Elf. She's still gorgeous. I'll take another Mystic Elf. So we finished on a hollow from Blue Eyes. Not bad. Yo, Island Man. Island Man's got some big news coming soon, too. Alright, so Mystic Elf at the end there. Let's go. Alright, now we're going to rip a Kaiba Legendary Collection, but I have no idea what's in this. I got two of them, we're going to open one. Uh, I don't know what I did with Alright. says there's three Legendary Collection Kaiba Mega Packs. There's a game board, and really this box is going to hold a lot of cards too, I think, so pretty cool box in general. Let's see what's in here. Alright, so there's a promo pack, Goddess of the Sweet Revenge. Pretty sick. And three mega packs. Alright, word. So there's just three packs in here. Oh wait, there's gotta be something under here, right? Oh cool. The game board it says. Oh look at that. Look at that. Wow. That's what you play on there. Pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. Hard map to play on. Probably would prefer the soft map, but that thing's actually got like a nice texture to it, like a leathery kind of feel. So I'm gonna keep those in there. And let's rip these three packs. I have no idea what to expect out of these, so. Uh, maybe we should have watched the video on ripping these. How am I doing on time? So I wanted this to take an hour. Budgeted an hour for this. What do we got? What do we got? We got 10 minutes. There's no way we're going to keep our budget. Neutron Blast. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon move. Oh, Utopia the Lightning. Number 39. He's got to be a good one. This is... We're going to have to... The first edition or anything with from from this set that might be a good one. I assume this is a good one. Awesome looking card in general. Utopia the Lightning, beautiful card. Soul reproduction, virus cannon, doom virus dragon, awesome thunder dragon hollow from this set. What a beautiful card. Wow, this they, all these cards are awesome from this, huh? Thunder Dragon, one of my fa personal favorite cards from back in the day. XYZ Dragon Cannon. Cost down. And the White Stone of the Ancients. Another one used mad in uh, the meta. Big part of the Blue Eyes deck. All right. First pack was pretty good. No blue. I imagine there's a blue eyes in here, though. Baden with eyes of blue. We're gonna sleeve her. Gorgeous card. Wow. Most beautiful version of that card I've seen. Another neutron blast. Parrot dragon. Kaiba man. Deck devastation virus. Virus card. Beautiful looking virus card. Bring in defense. GD crow. Another thunder dragon. Chain Disappearance, and Bezel the Diabolic Dragons is uh, going to have that secret rare hollow there. All right, LPM for this now. Let's go. Let's get a... I, guess I don't know what actually the big hit would be in here would be. Oh, 
Oh, blue eyes shining dragon. Beautiful. Look at that. Yeah, I love that Utopia card. There's the blue eyes shiny. Ancient rules. Soul exchange. Another Doom Virus. A Vorse Raider. Tonic. Sea Metal Tank. Another old school card. Retro card there. Another Cost Down. And a Dragon Ravine as the uh, spell card. Alright, cool. Kaiba Box is pretty awesome. Kaiba Legendary Collection Box. Got another one of those. I think I'm going to keep this one sealed. Also, we're kind of running out of time. Some pretty excellent cards in there. I'm going to give uh, the Maiden a sleeve. She deserves a sleeve. Gorgeous card. Guess I'm building a Blue Eyes deck now, huh? Huh, we're unstoppable. Guess I'm building a Blue Eyes deck now. Going down, boy. All right, goes from the past, and then we'll finish off with maximum, maximum G's. Huge night, though. What, what an epic rip. You, uh, retail Yugi's. Do not sleep on the retail Yugi's. I do my knife. Do not sleep on the retail Yugi's. A lot of fun to be had, at least. Alright, those packs are actually seated in there pretty nice. I have high hopes for the condition of the cards in these packs. Because of how nicely they were seated in there. It's non-typical. Usually they're all jammed in here sideways and like, I'm like, oh man. Those cards are definitely not coming out tens. Let's see how these are. See, these are a little bit worse. Those other ones were better. And then I open them like that, ripping, destroying the box, but. Uh, doing less damage to the packs, in my opinion. Alright, let's go. Ghost of the Past, chasing that Ghost Rare. I've yet to pull a Ghost Rare ever. So. Get that Ghost Rare. Virginity, Oblette, Heretic Dragon is set. Time Thief, Heretic Seal of Supremacy, and Lava Archer with massive print lines. Woof. Alright, first pack cold. First pack real cold. Starry Night Estelle. Sunvine Maiden. Tackle Crusader. Buster Dragon. Starry Night Arrival. Ooh. Punches in the gut. Oof. Third pack from that second box we opened. So far, not very good. The Mist Valley Baby Rock. With pretty bad print error there at the top. It's got like a little kiss mark there. Uh, you don't see that very often. Barnarch's Abrupt. Sun Avalon. XYZ Burst. And... Raid Raptor. Ay, ay, ay. Alright. Three more packs to go from the past. These are 15 bucks a box at, at Target. They sell them for like 25 Uh, resell. They're still not bad. But, again, these crap cards, it's kind of bad. 
Emergency Teleport, Time Thief, Chrono Quarter, and another Time Thief. So, stacking the Time Thieves. Absolutely stacking them. Kaiba Box, definitely the way to go. It seems like Sunseed, Genius Loki, Sunveil, Gardena, Lava Law Dragon. I haven't seen this one. Lava Vile Dragon, Heretic Seal of the Ashes, and Heretic Sky Dragon Overlord Heliopolis. Jeez. Whoa. Ron's looks like Ron Stoppable wants to Good night, dude. Hopefully, hopefully this last pack is the magic pack. Oh, Siryu. Good to see you, bud. Actually, this one's in pretty good shape, surprising. I don't see a print line on him. We're going to throw him in his sleeve. Rare Metal Foes Brismagear. Artificial Durndal. Evil Thorn. And Starry Night Rael. Ay, ay, ay. Beaten up by Ghost from the Past again. Deadly. Alright, maximum gold. To bring it around home. Maxi. Mago. As it says on the card. M A G O. Is the code. Let's go. Is there four packs in each of these, I think? Chasing the blue eyes, the red eyes, the dark magician. Um, oh, these are in here nice. These are in here very nicely. You don't see them usually like this either. that in my opinion how to get mago packs out is like this and that back kind of like kind of point it towards the camera but you don't want them to slip out like that if you can help it four packs in here i forgot there so it's been a while since i opened mago These are a little bit more expensive. See these these fell off. That's how they usually find them in there like that. Slipped off. And you gotta wonder what the conditions of the cards are. But these on the left side are in there pretty good still. So I'm just gonna bring that back. Rip that. Got a boom. Three. Okay. These cards are really hard to grade because they have gold edges. But the PSA 10 Blue Eyes White Dragon from this set is selling for a pretty penny. Got a comma on it. So, we got Union Hanger. We got Barrier Statue of the Inferno. Our first gold border is Borel Sword Dragon. Number 7 Galax 107 Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon. The battle card, but not what we're looking for. Our second. Gold Border is Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood. So the two ghost, uh, the two Gold Border cards are sorry ones so far. This is it. After this, we're done here. We're done here after this. What are we at? What's the time check? Tried to keep it under an hour. What are we at? What are we at? What are we at? 62 minutes. All right, it's pretty close. Close enough. Scalp Recycler. All right, go go. Gigas, Nurse Dragon Mane, Cutie, but not who we're looking for. <laughs> laundry Dragon Mane. Use the Laundry Dragon Mane. 
All right. Buster Blader, the Destroyer. Don't remember that guy. Noble Knight, Pelinor, Forbidden Chalice. That one might need a sleeve right away. Very nice condition. Oh man, saw the 3000 attack, I thought maybe blue eyes. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Noble Knight, HR, and Mage Power. Alright, here we go. Pulled off towards the end. We were hot there for a minute. All by the grave. Another Forbidden Chalice. Or just card. The edges are perfect. That one might grade well. Again, with the grading well for those cards. Alright, we went Master of Blades and then Apollo Uso, Bow of the Goddess. I don't know if I have this one yet. Be cool. Again, not one of the big three. Alright, here we go. Only a few more packs left. Three more packs left after this. Scrap Recycler. Synchron Carrier. Fire Formation. Fantastical. Dragon. Phantasme. Again, beautiful looking card. Almost perfect edges. Oh, Polymerization. Check that out. Another iconic one. Back to back there with the gold cards. Planet Pathfinder and Tuning. Tuning just added to uh, Duel Links. People are pretty excited about that uh, in Duel Links. Alright. Go, go, go. GGS. Trade in. Alistair the Invoker. Come on, Alistair. Oh, Red Eyes Black Dragon. Wow. Okay, here we go. Not bad. Not the blue eyes. But we got the red eyes. He's not centered very well. That's that's a shame. Because other than that, he is mint. But at least we got a card worth top loading, even in nine condition. Actually, I really got a card saver this one. For the card saver. I don't know what I did with them. It's also not centered perfect. <sighs> At least we got a red eyes. Very nice edges on them. Almost no damage. Like a coin. All right, we still got some packs left for it to heat up though. One red eyes. We got red, let's switch it to blue. We're at the red light, we're stopped at the red light. We need the blue light. We need that blue light. Buster Blader, the Destruction Swordsman now. The first Monarch. Start like Junkion. Reinforcements of the army. And Miscellaneous Asaurus. Alright. Alright, last pack magic. Last pack magic. We pushed hard into the Yu-Gi-Oh! retail. We did really, really well. Do a recap of the end of the cards that made it into... Um... Top loaders. Alright. Barrier Statue of the Inferno. All by the Grave. Oh, we got it. I can't even read that. 
Constellar, Paladies, um, number 71, Master of Blades, Barrier Statue of Storm Winds, and Ghost Order and Snow Rabbit is the last gold barrier card. Maximum Gold continues to be one of the hardest products to hit good cards out of repeatedly. Get all those cards into soft sleeves. And we'll do a quick recap here. Uh, kind of going back in order. But we'll end with the blue, with the... So we got Siryu out of um, Ghost from the Past. The only reason why I'm even showing this card off is it looks like it could possibly pen. Very nicely centered. Um, Red Eyes Black Dragon, like a $10 card raw. Centering is pretty bad. Uh, other than that, looks like a 10. We got uh, one ultra rare from Pharaoh Servant, Premature Burial. Got a couple rares, rare hollows from uh, Invasion of Chaos. And then we got two ultra rares, it looks like. What do we get? I forget. We got, oh yeah, Mana Core of Darkness and Dimension of Fusion. That was nice. From IOC. And then from IOC, we went into Spell Ruler, which was an odd six packs from Spell Ruler. We got the Giant Tornade. And then we proceeded to pull Black Illusion Rituals over and over again so three of those that's pretty crazy then we went to metal raiders and really killed it as well we got the ultra rare change of heart and two rare hollows karibo and harpy lady sisters that was awesome and then we also for metal raiders just to kick it into high gear we pulled the secret rare gate guardian not bad center he looks pretty good so that was huge and then lob we put we ripped three packs and we managed to get a mystical elf so pretty huge night overall uh i was excited still some cards out there that we need to find the trihorn dragon so we're gonna keep on ripping thanks everybody who watched everybody who liked 100% like rating. Love that. You guys are the best. Thanks for Ron Stoppable for stopping by. Island Man, Nick Strength, Nikki G, Brian. Love you guys. We'll be back, uh, back soon. Big things happen. 500 followers is coming. 500 follower giveaway will come. 500 follower giveaway. We'll see. All right, later, everybody. Good night.